There's lots of different ways to kind of start getting in and start making change, right? Some of them can be related to musculoskeletal, some can relate to psychosocial, emotional. The way that the health optimization medicine works is by looking at what's called metabolomic data. So this is data with something you can actually measure in the cells, looking at real-time workings of how well you can make energy, how well you're detoxing from the energy you make, how optimized your gut is, neurotransmitters, hormones. And the focus is to shift all these nutrient, gut, hormone, neurotransmitter networks to ideal levels, to the levels when you are between 21 and 30 years of age, because that's when we're most optimized. That's when we're most resilient. That's when we're the highest ability to procreate, to fight, all those kinds of things, fight and fornicate, right? And so the goal with the whole process is to shift all those networks there. And you shift them using vitamins, minerals, nutrients, supplementation, hormones sometimes, gut optimization. And then you also look at the various other aspects of what we do. So looking at circadian rhythms, so chronobiology, looking at toxic exposures, looking at epigenetics and exercise, of course, being a big part of that. Gut health is a big part, as I mentioned. Really big focus on mitochondria, so bioenergetics and understanding how we can truly optimize mitochondrial function. This is obviously diet. This is obviously lifestyle. This is not just giving people supplements and just shifting their networks. It's it's shifting their whole biology and their lifestyle and their diet to a place where it's going to be most optimized personally for them.